So my room is on level five. Top row. <laughs> Top row. My room is on level five. Room number five two five, I believe. So here is the room, I do apologise, we have uh, had a quick nap in here after a long haul flight. So there's a double bed and a sofa bed. There is plenty of USB chargers. Nice big screen TV. Mirror at our workstation. And a little table. coffee making facilities we have a fridge also have a light up wardrobe which is nice with an iron an extra duvet some towels iron board and more coat hangers into the ensuite this big mirror, more towels, toilet, shower and a bath. The view outside the window is of a wonderful looking car park. We are on the top floor as well. The hotel has a fantastic restaurant with these fantastic looking foods. I've got myself an alcoholic beverage. I'm waiting for my meal. This bar is really, really nice. Friendly and nice and warm and inviting. For my meal, I have gone with the Pei Peri chicken and chips corn the cob. That looks absolutely beautiful. I cannot wait to get stuck into what this. What can I say? That was absolutely beautiful. And the surroundings, what more can you say? They're absolutely amazing. Hi guys, how are you doing? So, for the holiday in at Gatwick Airport, the room, I'm gonna give three out of five. It was a nice room, it was nice and tidy. So, three out of five for the room, it was tidy, it was clean, it was nice. Location, I'm going to give three out of five. You are literally maybe a five minute drive on a bus, you get the bus outside. The buses are every 20 minutes. So for the facilities, I'm going to give it two and a half out of five. The Wi-Fi was fine, so the restaurant downstairs was really, really nice. The food was really, really good as well. So for the facilities, I'm going to give it two and a half out of five, which I think is a fair score. Overall, for the Holiday Inn at Gatwick, I'm going to give it three out of five. It's a nice hotel, nice and clean, very friendly staff, quite close to the airport. Everything you need for a quick layover. Or, if you're like us, at the end of a long haul flight, Oh, get me on that bed. <laughs> really cheap as well. Um, for myself and the two girls, it was £85 for one night, which is absolutely perfect for what we needed. So overall, 3 out of 5 for me. Anyway guys, thank you for watching this hotel review. And I'll see you again soon for the next one. Because I have a lot of hotel reviews to do. Bye now. Now that you